Good evening. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Ryan Fish. The Loft Film Festival brought in big crowds over the past two weeks, but the iconic Midtown Movie Theater on Speedway has even bigger plans for 2024. I sat down with the Loft's executive director for an announcement you'll see first here on Kega. Last year, the Loft Cinema celebrated its 50th anniversary. Next year is the beginning of a new era as the loft looks to expand. What we have now is not accessible. The restrooms aren't accessible. Upstairs theater is not accessible. And the lobby is just way too small. The line for concessions goes outside and down the side of the building. Now there are plans for a new building connecting the two already here. Right now this is just blank land. Just, just yeah. nothing there. <laughs> yeah. All new restrooms, all new concession stands, all new box office, larger space. We'll have an elevator upstairs and then upstairs we're having a rooftop bar which we think people will enjoy. The biggest change will be the existing lobby and restrooms will be demolished and that will be made into a really nice lounge. The existing screens won't be changed but there will be a new permanent outdoor screen with a seating area on artificial turf. The way that it's situated it'll always be shaded from the afternoon sun. We broadcast the sound for the film through an FM signal and people have headsets so you're getting really good quality sound right next to your ear with no speedway traffic and it doesn't bleed into the neighborhood so we can have late movies. The budget for this transformation is three million dollars with the nonprofit theater still looking to raise more than a million. Luckily the loft already has several supporters. You come here and you feel like you're part of the family. It's old school when I grew up how the cinemas used to be. I love the loft. The loft gives you different perspectives that are very timely and really sensitive. I've been volunteering here about seven years and it's just a great gathering place for people who love films. The building isn't quite at the same level as the programming so we need to bring the building up so that it matches more or less the quality of what we're offering the community. The hope is for construction to start in March and last nine to twelve months. You can see the full expansion plans on our website, kagan9.com.